Hello and welcome back. Today on the bench we have a Colt government model with a Monarch Rifleette shoulder stock. Now uh, these Rifleette shoulder stocks were made by the Monarch, uh, excuse me, Monarch Arms and Manufacturing Company out of Los Angeles, California, made somewhere in the 20s to 30s. I have a brochure that will be featured in one of the next videos I do on these. There's two more of these in the collection. One is on a Super 38, and another one is on a Model S, or a Pre-Woodsman, and I'll feature that brochure in one of the upcoming videos. But anyway, what we have here is this combination that was set up for this 1911, and we'll go ahead and just take a look at it. This 1911 being from about 1926, if I haven't said that already, you can see we keep the uh, standard uh, walnut grip on this side, and then on this side, we have an aluminum grip that uh, attaches in the normal spots with the grip screws. But then it also has these uh, screws for the shoulder stock itself. Now, this is made, of course, out of aluminum, so it's halfway uh, light. And uh, it has a kind of a stippled paint pattern on it to give it a little bit of texture. But you can see on here it has the uh, patents applied for. And then we also have manufactured by Monarch Arms in Manufacturing Company, Los Angeles, California. Now this is yet to be cleaned, so I'll be uh, spending a considerable amount of time working on this over the next night or two. And then we also have this extended uh, magazine, which was known as an anti-bandit magazine. And uh, it has here on the side, multi-shot. So uh, there you go. Um, I'm not sh quite sure of the capacity of this magazine. I haven't tried to load it up, so I'm not quite certain as to that. But this goes together uh, really pretty easy. As you can see here, we just flip this over and put it on here like this. We'll grab our screws here. Really easy. Now, the uh, Monarch Arms Company probably became the Western Arms Company. It's really hard to find anything written about these. So if anybody has any information regarding the uh, Monarch Arms Company, please Feel free to leave uh, that information that you have in the comment section below and uh, so we can see what, uh, what else is known about it. There's not much written on it that I could find before I did this video. So here we go. That's what it looks like together. Now, you won't be able to really see how it's held, but this gives a really nice stable platform for shooting. I can imagine this was probably a lot of fun to shoot. Now it's got these two set screws here. By loosening one and tightening the other, you can slowly change the angle of this. So you have to just back one out and tighten the other one down and it will move this. But anyway, there you go. This is a short little video showing the uh, Monarch Arms Rifleette shoulder stock and anti-bandit magazine combination on a government model uh, Colt automatic from probably 1926. Alright, hey, thanks for tuning in and watching. I hope you enjoyed this short video and have a great night.